Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. In this week's exploration of the solar system, we are going to discuss the Mars part of the Mars program and the Mars, specifically the Mars four through seven spacecraft that were sent by the Soviet Union to explore the planet Mars. Now here they are listed. So let's take a look at them. Mars four was launched in July of 73 and flew by Mars in February of 1974. However, a computer failure prevented it from achieving orbit, which was the intention. So it just ended up flying by Mars and was not able to really get a whole lot there. Mars five also launched in July of 73 and arrived at Mars around the same time. However, it had an issue where a micrometeorite impact. So just a tiny little bit of material that impacted it. And that ended up shortening its mission and not being as, as successful as would have been hoped. It did study the atmosphere and did detect an ozone layer in on, around Mars. Now the Mars six and seven spacecraft launched in August of uh, 1973 and reached Mars the following March in March of 1974. Now in this case the landers uh, failed in which case the first one contact was simply lost. So from Mars 6 we don't know exactly what happened except that contact was lost and it's assumingly it is crashed on the surface but we don't know where and of course if it crashed there's going to be no contact with it uh, from after that time. We do know from Mars 7 it was a rocket failure for the Mars 7 spacecraft that affected it. Now those affected the landers however the orbiting and for flyby craft were able to get some information. So each of these craft was able to return some data but most of the, it was corrupted or unusable. So unfortunately a lot of the uh, craft the Soviet Union sent to Mars did not succeed as well as other missions. And we've seen that as we've studied the various craft that have been exploring the solar system. There have been a lot of great successes and there have been a lot of things that didn't go exactly as we had hoped. And the Mars missions here are one of those that really didn't go as well as we would have liked. We've also looked at some of the Venera craft from the Soviet Union, which also were not perfectly successful but did give us a lot more information on the planet Venus. So let's go ahead and finish up with our summary and what we've looked at here is that the Mars 4 through 7 craft were intended to orbit and then land on Mars. Unfortunately each mission had various issues which prevented successful completion of those missions. Although some data and some images were returned to Earth for study. So that concludes this discussion of the Mars 4 through 7 spacecraft. We'll be back again next time for another exploration of the solar system. So until then have a great day everyone. And I will see you in class.